what up guys welcome back to another video in today's video we're gonna be doing i'm gonna go through every fan art that i can find of my oc slash me so these were all the fan arts that i can find now here are some exceptions some of them are not all of them are on here like i didn't i decided to not include uh stick notes me from an average dude because i just don't think stick notes to me is art even though if it was included, it would probably be the best one on here. But but for now, we're going to include these. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that bell for more notifications. Anyways, let's get started. So first off, we have uh, Calamardo's version of one of us versions of me. And it's pretty good. It's a really good version of me. Even though my hair is a bit longer, I actually do like this new hairstyle he gave my OC. And he did, and he gave my character way better shoes, and I just think it's way better than what I did. Overall, pretty good version of my OC, 9 out of 10. Next up, next up is, is squidus.mpg, I think that's what it says. This is also pretty good. It's probably better than the other one because it's basically a, a more creepy version of... Me. There's a lot. There's a few creepy versions of me on here, but this is one of his, and it's pretty good. It's a really good version. I I say it's also a nine out of ten. Next up is Squidus.exe. Now this was originally a drawing that I did on my old channel. You can't see it, of course, because well that channel's now all gone. But it's pretty good. I actually really like it. I I liked how he made my glasses broken. I don't think it's as good as the other two, but it's still pretty good. I'm going to give it a 8 out of 10. Next up is this version of my OC. Now, this was a profile picture that I used to wear on my old channel, but I don't wear it anymore because it's really hard to choose which one I should wear because they're all good. But this one is pretty good, too. I like how my OC is mostly red and black because that's personally my favorite two colors. Overall, pretty good. Uh, 9 out of 10. Next up is Randy's version, and it's really good as well. It, oh, crap. I didn't mean to do that, but it's pretty good. I like how he used the art style of me from Unbeatable YouTubers Mix from Mickey Mixer. It's pretty good. It's I wouldn't say it's better than Calamardo's, but it's still pretty good. I'd say, like, a solid 8 out of 10. Next. Next up is another unbeatable version of me, but this is from Ryan E slash Star Bandigal instead of Mickey Mixer. It's pretty good. I like it. It's pretty good. I don't know why my, the Supreme thing is all the way down there, but it's pretty good. I say solid eight. Next up is me using spray on Doofus. Now, I couldn't get the whole thing, but this is the best I could get. And it's pretty good. I like I like this one better than the other one if I... If if I had to be honest. It's pretty good. I say a solid 8.5 out of 10. Next up is my character as a South Park character. It's good, but it's definitely not the best one. Honestly, I don't I don't think my character fits as a South Park character because I just simply don't think it does. It's not bad, but but overall, I just don't think my character fits as a South Park character. I say like a 6 out of 10. Next up is D-Sides Me. Now, this is pretty good. So, this is what my character would be like if he was a D-Sides. And it's pretty good. I really like the unibrow that he has. Well, I think that's a unibrow. And and turns me into the nerd emoji, <laughs> which is funny. A uh, solid 9. Next up is uh, the Respiral, but... Hey, no bad, but it includes me too, but... I like, I like the face expression he made of my character. Overall, pretty good. It's too it's a little too simple, but it's pretty good. Uh, 7 out of 10. Next up is Piracy Squidoos, and it's pretty good too. I really like the uh, the red and black again and the glitch effects. It's pretty good. I say solid 8.5. Next up is just me, just regular me. Now, this was actually suggested by Hey Nobez, and... It was pretty sweet of him to actually tell him to make this for me. Like, I didn't expect this at all, but I'm still very happy he did. And it's a solid 8. 
Next up is Z.J's version. Now, this version is good, but it's a little too simple for me. It's it's a little too simple, and I don't know why my character on the left side is human, because my character's not human. He's anthropomorphic, but overall, it's all right. I say, like, a solid six. Next up is another piracy squidoo, but this is from GB, and this one is so fucking good. It's way better than than star band ghouls i'm not i'm not trying to favor it but this one is definitely a lot more better but overall this one's fantastic this one's a 10 out of 10 for me next up is is me running from like a prey mix this is also by gb and this one's definitely not as good as the uh piracy one but oh it's still pretty good i say like a, a 8 out of 10 because i just don't like the face expression now, next one is Daniel's version, and honestly, I do not like this one. First off, why is my OC bald? First off, my character literally has hair. Literally has hair. So, you messed that up. And why is the Supreme thing all the way at the bottom? And I don't wear blue pants. I wear Supreme red pants. Overall, this one is, is not really that good. I'm giving it a three. I don't care. Next up is Matias, and it's pretty good. Like, I gave him a drawing tutorial on how to draw my OC, and it's good. It's way better than Daniel's, and I don't care what anyone says. It's pretty good. I say like a solid 7. Next up is Mickey Mixer's unbeatable version of me, and it's pretty good. I really like how he made my hair very spiky. <laughs> I also like how he made it brown, even though my... OC's hair isn't brown, but I, I'll, I'll accept it. Stupid ass fly wanted. Overall, this is a very good one. 9.5 out of 10. Next up is my dead OC. Uh, this one is pretty good. I, I don't know why he gave me bones, because uh, I'm pretty sure squids don't have bones. So I don't know why that's there, but it's still really fantastic. Also a 9.5. Next up is a... EXE version of my character. It's pretty good. It's a 10 out of 10 of questions. Next up is my character as an octoling, and it's also pretty good. I really love the Mickey Mouse shoes he gave me. It's so adorable. It makes me, it makes an alpha child, like, I can't speak, but they're so cute, and I like how he's doing the hand gesture thing. Overall, this one is amazing. 10 out of 10. Next up is another Squidoo's EXE, but this time it's from Hayden. I don't think it's as good as Calamaris, but it's still fantastic. It, it's This one's more of an FNF kind of style, even though the other one was also an FNF style. This one's still pretty good, though. 9 out of 10. Next up is Gore Squid. I don't know if Gore Squid technically counts as my OC, but it's an evil version of my OC, so I still think it counts for the list. Overall, this one's pretty good. A bro guy acne puncture. It's pretty good. I also like that purple is the one running away from this version of him. I thought that was pretty accurate because you all know how how much I despise that character. <laughs> and we're not even going to talk about it. So anyways, this one's good. It's 10 out of 10. Next up is my profile picture. Also made by Hey Nobez. Now, it's my profile picture. What do you expect? It's a 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10, no questions. This one is uh, my character if he was a starved Eggman kind of character. It's pretty good. I don't know why my OC's eyes are very small. <laughs> it makes him a little derpy, but it's still pretty cool. I still think it's a 9 out of 10. Next up is the Gore Squid by, by uh, Calamardo again. But this time he calls it Gore Dues, and this one's way better. Uh, this one, I don't even need to answer. This is 11 out of 10 for me, folks. Next up is uh, another Prey featuring me, and this one is by Star Mario this time, and it's pretty good. This is probably the best one out, out of I've seen because it just looks really good, despite my hair being a little wonky, but it's still pretty good. A uh, solid 9 out of 10. Next one is the other one. This one is from the same video, but it's in a different position. This one is probably better than this one because it has a better 
looking hair. Anyways, pretty good. A solid nine. Next up is a dead version of my OC again from Starve. This one's definitely a lot more fucking brutal than Mickey Mixer's by a long shot. It literally looks like I'm a dead corpse. This one is pretty good, though. I'm giving it a solid... I'm giving it a 10. Next up is my OC as an EXE. I captured Souls, Doofus, Star Bandicles, Suicidal Mouse Gamings, and, um, and Mickey Mixers. And it's really, really cool. I like it. It's a very cool version of my OC. And yeah, he would be an EXE if he wasn't an EXE universe. Overall, pretty good. I say that's a 10 out of 10. Next up is, he's over here, by the way. This is my next one by Star of Mario, and it's pretty good, too. I really like it. I think Star of Mario has done the best ones besides Calamardo's. Overall, this one's fantastic. Overall, solid 9 out of 10. And finally, we have the last one to rank, and this is a Pippi. This is supposed to be uh, ROC's doing the fam one Pippi Family Guy song, and my head is over here. It's pretty good. <laughs> Definitely very creepy. I'll, I'll admit, it, it, this one is very creepy looking. <laughs> it's pretty good. Uh, 9.5 out of 10. And that's all of the fan arts that is included. If you have some fan art for me, let me know and I'll do a part two of this. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Hit that bell for more notifications. Anyways, I'll see you next time.